Hey guys, this is Wads with the Wads Up channel. How are you guys doing? And thanks for joining me again today. Today I'm here to share with you a moto transport system or motorbike transport system. Now in the past, in part one, I reviewed Risk Racing's lock and load system. It failed rather horribly. So then I did some research and I came across these guys called bike binders. Now I tested them exactly the same as I did Risk Racing system, the lock and load system, uh, except this system, uh, it passed. But uh, I wanted to do a follow-up review because this is two years later. And I want to show you guys how uh, the bike binder system has fared after almost two years and also share with you why I think it's one of the best systems around and why it's worth considering. So here's what it looks like after two years, right? It's beaten up, um, but it's two years of me abusing it. Um, but it has absolutely passed. None of these chains have ever come out of here. These, so they provide you this lock system here. These clip in and they, you can adjust them along this track. They've never come out once in two years. And this bike, you know, 300 miles of doing that and they're fine. Over the peg, pin down, lever up. In goes in. While well, you got the one chain on the other peg on the other side already secured, you can just pull the bike over with your hand or sit on the bike, secure the bike binder onto the peg, locking pin goes down, you pull up this lever and then you just install the safety pin through the lever mechanism. You can get them in green, you can get them in blue, orange to match your bike. Um, if you use the wads up code, they'll throw it in for free, the powder coating that is. So you're good there. Bottom line guys, the bike binders are fast, they're durable, they're strong, and super quick to load your bike. Watch how fast this is. Start your clock. So you don't necessarily have to use them for a trailer. You can put a set in your truck or in your trailer or, or in your toy hauler. So they've got lots of flexibility. They're good for five from 50 cc all the way up to 450 cc and, and higher. This is a 500 cc. Um, so about, I believe it's around for this particular model, it's 275 working load uh, max limit. Um, but they do make a set for snow bikes. It's considerably higher. When you move it down the road and the trailer's moving, then the suspension is just doing all the work and you haven't got your front forks compressed down and getting worked, which I never liked that idea, but I like this. I like the natural suspension just kind of moving. And I don't like the idea of torquing down my front forks. Um, so this is a sturdy system, well worth considering guys. If you have any other questions, let me know. Um, but I just wanted to share with you a two year review. These things are holding up and I still give them a double thumbs up. Smash that subscribe button if I brought you some value today and we'll talk to you guys soon. Peace.